Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me here today with another Zara haul. Um, it's not as massive as you think because I didn't plan this to be a haul. I basically just ordered the items because I really wanted them and I wanted to give them a try. So yeah, I have some beautiful Tweety spring bits in here um, that I hope you'll enjoy. So let's unbox it, try it on and see what they're like. If you're new to my channel today, then I am Anna and I post fashion styling videos every Monday and also mostly on Fridays at 7 p.m. So if you do not want to miss any of them, then make sure that you're subscribed to my channel. And if you generally enjoy fashion and outfit inspiration, then make sure that you also follow me on Instagram because that's where I post every single day. All right, let's unbox this baby. Okay, so here's my first outfit and I do have to say I really like this one. Um, so I've got this top and this skirt um, and the skirt actually is a skirt, um, which I think is really, really practical. Um, and I do have to say, I really like this one. Um, I feel like the quality is pretty nice. I'm wearing a size S, um, which is my regular size. And the quality is pretty decent um, for it being 29.99. And you have to remember, I'm talking about Euro prices, so probably it's gonna be cheaper um, in pounds. Um, so yeah, I really like this one. It's kind of a creamy color. I'm gonna come a bit closer so that you can see. So it's kind of a cream color and then it has like this gray and pink check to it and these like silver buttons. Um, and I have to... And I have to say, this one I think is not too bad of the length. Um, I feel like it's definitely better um, than this like pink gingham skirt that I have. Um, I feel like this one's much more decent. Not a lot. Well, a bit. <laughs> um, yeah, so I really like this one. And then I've paired this like little white crop top with it. Um, so again, I'm going to come a bit closer. So as you can see, it's like a very like ruched um, bodice area with this like uh, straight bit down the bottom. It's very cropped, but it is a very stretchy material. Um, so definitely you can wear your normal size in this. Um, and it has quite puffy sleeves um, that are also elasticated and also these... Um, like tighter fitting sleeves. I do have to say I really like this top but the quality of it is not the best. Like this fabric feels like you could sweat quite easily in it. It feels a bit plasticky and to be honest I don't really know when I would ever wear this because obviously it's a very short crop top so it's meant for the summer months um, but then again the material is like long sleeved and kind of sweaty so I don't know when I'll ever want a long sleeve top in a warm material that is cropped. Um, I don't know, it's just not something I really reach for. Um, yeah, and also I do have to say I feel a bit restricted in the arms because there's no stretch um, around the sleeves and because they're so puffy, obviously the seam is a bit down. So um, yeah, it does restrict you a bit. It's not too bad, like you could still reach everything. But uh, yeah, I just don't think it's like the best top you could get. Um, I think there are much nicer tops out there. Um, but yeah, I do have a matching jacket for the skirt, so I'm definitely just going to quickly pop that on to show you. Okay, so here comes the matching jacket, and as you can see, it just looks like a completely different look now. I really, really love this set. I think it's so Beverly Hills. Um, it's like Rodeo Drive, palm trees. Um, I just love this outfit. It's so chic, but it's very fun at the same time. And I just love this like muted colors with the pink in it that just give it a bit of fun and spice, but like not too obvious. Um, so you could definitely still subtly wear this. Um, I'm gonna come a bit closer so you can see the jacket a bit better. We have again these gorgeous buttons and these um, two little pockets. It's not really a crop jacket. It's kind of like just a very like shortcut jacket. Um, round neck, a bit of padded shoulders. Again, I'm wearing a size S. And to be honest, around the shoulders it could actually fit a bit tighter, but Again, if you do want to be able to wear something underneath comfortably, then um, this is just perfect. And I think the fit of this is just absolute perfection. So I think this is one of the best um, fitted sets that Zara has brought out. So I definitely really like this. I really like these together, um, but also as separates. I think they're very cute. And because it's cream, it could be a bit um, harsh to combine, but I actually think it does work with white. Because there's enough difference between the white and the cream, I think you could definitely pair it together with white, but also with like grey or pink, it will look great. Uh, so yeah, definitely really liking that one. Okay, before I get changed, I quickly wanted to drop these in. These are a pair of like white boots. Um, they're knee high and I'm really excited because I think my wardrobe definitely needs a pair like these, but... 
um, yeah, I'll just try them on, I'll insert like a vertical clip on the side because I don't really have space filming otherwise. So yeah, I just popped these boots on and I do think they fit quite nice around the leg. I like that they're a bit slouchy um, so that you do have room to like tuck trousers in as well. Um, but the heel is quite high, it's like pretty high for me, I'm almost getting my head out of the frame. Um, so I don't know if they're that comfortable to wear all day. Um, and if maybe the material is a bit too shiny for me. So yeah, definitely let me know what you think about these. Okay, next up I have a little knitted set. Um, and I really like th this kind of style of it because it has the type of style of like a tweed set. But it's knitted, so it's more comfortable and it's warmer. So that's why I really wanted to try it out. Just because I feel like um, tweed sets can sometimes be a bit too cold still if it's like really chilly outside and this could even look like great with some woolen tights um, and some ankle boots and then I think you just have a perfect like look for the more chillier days um, and I do have to say it is so comfortable it is so nice to wear this um, so I'm gonna come a bit closer as you can see it's like pink and green check which obviously is quite fun and different for me um, but I do like baby pink and I do like this like very dark emerald Green. I think it always has like a bit of a royal uh, twist to it. The skirt as you can see is like quite tight fitted but it is really like roomy and stretchy so it's very nice um, to wear. I think the length is perfect. I'm wearing a size S. Um, you could definitely size up if you want a few extra inches but I don't think you need to because it's like knitted. It's gonna hang down anyways um, after a couple of time of wearing it. So I think that's absolutely fine. And then this like knitted vest that sits on top, um, it's actually quite long, um, like as you can see from, from the sides, it's like very long, so I definitely wouldn't wear it like that. Um, so I tucked it inside of my bra actually to give it that um, fit, and I do think it's really nice like that. Um, I do think, you know, you could pop a turtleneck underneath um, to give it more of a stylish look. Uh, but in general, I do think it fits quite nice. It's also a size S, um, so if you could size down in this top half, whatever this is, uh, then I'd definitely recommend doing this, um, because I feel like it's quite bulky, way bulkier than the skirt, which is a nice balance, but I think if it comes in a smaller size than your usual one, then you could definitely size down in it. Um, I do have to say, though, the buttons I really, really like. They are quite similar to the ones... Uh, on my Pretty Affluent skirt. So um, yeah, really a big fan of the buttons, obviously. Um, so yeah, that's the look. Let me know what you think about this one. Okay, next up I have a pair of pink jeans and I've actually seen them quite a while ago and had them on my wish list. I wasn't sure whether or not to order them. So I thought next time I do an order, I'll just throw them in. Um, so that's what I did. Um, and I do have to say, I've been on the hunt for like a good pair of like pale pink jeans for quite a while. Um, these are not pale pink, they're quite bright pink. Um, but let me tell you, it's so hard to find a good shade of pink because most of the jeans out there that are pink are kind of salmon pink and that's a pink I really don't like. Um, but I've tried to be a bit experimental with the mom jean style because I know that skinny jeans sadly aren't like in style anymore. Um, and I do think they have a bit of a dated look to them sometimes, but still they're my favorite types of jeans. So I thought I'd, you know, try out something like this, um, which is obviously a bit more on trend. And I do have to say, I really, really love how they fit on the top half. They're nice and high waist. I do think they make great bum. I do like the color. I love like the thickness of the denim. I think it's a really good quality. Um, and it's $39.99, so that's probably like uh, £29.99. Pounds. Um, so yeah, I really, really like these. The only thing is I have no clue how to style mom jeans. Like literally, um, I'm in, like not really good person to style jeans in general, but especially not these like cool mom jeans. So if they were like, like a bit tighter around around my ankles. Um, maybe I could roll them up and that would look better, but yeah, just let me know your thoughts on styling mom jeans because uh, yeah, I definitely need your help. Um, but I do think they have something cool, but I feel like it makes me look quite boxy and that's not really the kind of vibe I like, so uh, not too sure about these. Okay, so last but not least, I do have this gorgeous little two-piece and I've seen this one in Freddy's video. Um, and this was one of like the pieces that I thought, okay, I'm gonna try these out. Um, and I do have to say, I have a very similar set from Topshop that I never ever wear because it's so uncomfortable um, and the top is way too tight for me. So I thought this could be a new and refreshed version of this one. Um, and I do have to say, I, 
I do like it um, it's not bad but I really much prefer that the, the top is so long so that it kind of really well blends with the skirt and obviously you could you know pull it up or down um, depending on how much skin you want to show but I do like that you don't have to show skin I do really like that it just blends in so you could also wear this out for dinners where you may be blowed um, I feel like that's much more comfortable and gives you more ways to actually wear this out um, I do however have to say that the top is pretty tight I'm gonna come a bit closer um, it has some like boning in, inside of it um, but as you can see around the, this boob area it's so so small and I do not have a lot of cleavage but it just presses everything out so if that's the look you want uh, then great otherwise I would definitely recommend to size up just because it makes this whole thing a lot more comfortable um, and if you do have like even the tiniest bit of cleavage I would sh size up because literally I have none and <laughs> it looks like this so uh, yeah besides that the sleeves are really nice they're nice and puffy um, and I do like the skirt the skirt is actually like more of my favorite part of this outfit. I do love this like structured detail at the side and obviously the peplum and the fact that for once it's a sensible length of a mini skirt from Zara. So I do like it. I feel like in the reflection it looks more like a dress than an actual two piece but um, yeah there's definitely two pieces of clothing involved. Um, so yeah I do really like the skirt. I have to say that. Um, I'm not a big fan on the top. I wish the top um, was a bit more like roomy even though it's quite stretchy at the back I think you should definitely size up in it uh, but then again it's not gonna have a cropped effect at all um, so yeah I don't know if this set is going to be for me but I definitely wanted to include it um, and yeah that's so far everything so guys these were all the bits that I shopped at Zara let me know which items were your favorite if you think I should keep anything or send anything back and then I'll say thank you so so much for watching and I'll see you next time bye mm -hmm.